Hey guys, so why does this look so overexposed? Oh no. Should be good. So um I just showered and like got myself together, put the wig on, kind of wet it up so the curls pop in. Now let me tell you how to this date this wig is my favorite my favorite style is body wave which you know nice loose effortless waves but this wig is my absolute favorite out of all the wigs that i currently have because i just feel like the curls frames my face really nicely and i absolutely love that so i'm on my husband is traveling and i <clears throat> when he's traveling i always make sure that you know the kids have some really nice, cute stuff. So, I'm going through and I'm getting my daughter like a cute little backpack, maybe from Shein, because Shein sells them for cheap. And they are still super cute. And she goes to church with my mom all the time. So, I also wanted to get her a cute little bag that she could wear to church. I have a cute little black bag that she says she likes, but, and I am sending that one for her but I just wanted to get her um you know another cute little one that she could carry around with her especially because you know um in the holidays she's always on the road with my mom so um I want to just get her a cute little bag that she could have with her I want to see how tiny they are though because sometimes they are so tiny they literally cannot hold anything but I think I'll buy her that one and I'll buy another one for Hales because um these bags are super cute so um that's what i'm doing i have some stuff on target that i want to get every time somebody's going to jamaica we always try to make sure that the kids get stuff so you know they're not short or nothing so that is what is up i'm just trying to get some last minute stuff well it's not really last minute because i still have like a week or two before but you know with shipping and everything, you kind of have to give it enough time to be late and shit. So I want to try and get what I'm getting from early, but these are super cute. So far. So that's what I have going on. I'm going to, I have my coffee here with me. I woke up with a headache. Oh, I need to take two painkillers. But I woke up with a headache and <clears throat> I hate when you know that's how my day is started that is not my favorite thing at all but you know i'm trying not to complain too much i'm in good health you know i'm fine so i'm trying to not really complain too much but um yeah i'm just doing a little bit of shopping here and there to get some cute things and that is pretty much what i have going on so um I guess I'll see you guys later, or I'll pick the vlog. Oh my gosh, I have a vlog to edit. Jesus. I feel like there are not enough hours in a day. Anyways, later, y'all. Guys, I just got home, and it is dumping rain outside. Like, it's just raining. And raining and raining. Oh my god. Not my favorite thing at all, but I got, um... A letter apparently and I just go right ahead and tear that up you know how when you get letters and you just know that it's junk and then I got a package from Amazon I also have some more stuff that I want to order from Amazon but maybe later because today I ordered some stuff so firstly I want to show you guys this. It is a journal. Just It's called Just Between Us. And it's a mother-daughter, no stress, no rules journal. And I was reading some reviews on it. And I really like it. You see how the very first page. Oh, so this is what the cover looks like. And, wow, my bag of jasmine rice is just on the table like that. And this is what the you know that part looks like i always 
I'm that type of parent who always wants my daughter to feel like, you know, it's okay to express exactly how she feels as long as she does that in a respectful way. Let me close this window. It's a good thing that today wasn't like a super cold day because it would have been freezing inside here. So yeah, I'm that parent who wants my daughter to express how she feels, you know, as long as it's done in a respectful way. And you know, sometimes they can't really, or they are afraid to tell you exactly how they feel. So I wanted to get her something that she could write her feelings in. And you know, the front tells you a whole lot, a whole lot about a daughter's perspectives and just all types of stuff. A mother's perspective and then it has you know the pages that you actually write how you fill in and I feel like this will be really good my daughter and I have a really good relationship which I am so grateful for but um yeah sometimes you know you can't put into words how you feel so I'm going to start filling out some parts of this book so I can send it to her and then um yeah she can like go through the rest but yeah I'm, I'm I like like cute stuff like this so yeah I like that it's super cute and I can't wait to write in there and so let me just tell you guys something right That kid said she wanted Jolly Rancher. And I bought <laughs> five pounds of Jolly Rancher. <laughs> that is so wild. This is such a big bag. Shit, this is so much candy. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to keep some and then I'm going to send the rest and I'm going to package it out for them. So it's not going to just be hers. It's going to be for her and her sisters and her brother. But I always loved Jolly Rancher growing up, so yeah. But, um, a dress is in the box. Because if you do not know, you can buy things on Amazon. And, oh, it's such, it's such a nice material. We are having a party and I have nothing to wear. And the theme is yellow and I found this cute little dress on Amazon. But when I'm looking at it right now, it looks damn tiny. So, I really need to go try it on and see how much I like it and stuff like that. But... I just got home, I'm gonna make some coffee, cut this damn box up, and, um, yeah, try the dress on, but yeah. So guys, I decided to try the dress on, and I absolutely love it. Absolutely love it. <laughs> and I feel like I could low-key wear this wig with it. I love it. I have something similar to this, but it's mustard and the sleeves aren't as fancy, but I love... Listen, Amazon really has been coming through. It's been a long time since Amazon has been coming through for me, but I love this. Oh. Oh. Your girl is happy. Hey guys, so been home for a little minute and I've really just been chilling. <coughs> But I think that I'm about to go take a shower and like lay down. Tomorrow is Sunday and I don't really have, I mean, I do, but not really, you know, anything much. I feel like I want to just chill in bed and like scroll through my socials. I also just bought a dress on Fashion Nova. I'm going to put a picture of the dress on the screen to show it to you guys. I have a party that I'm going to be need, I'm going to need to attend. So I wanted to buy the dress from early because Fashion Nova says that um, somebody left a review and said that the dress fits a little bit big. So normally I'd wear a medium, but I'm like, let me just get a small since she said it fits big. But I wanted to order it from early just in case it doesn't fit big and the small don't fit me and I'm going to have to return it. Then I still have enough time to return it and buy the same dress in another size. So that right now would be my dilemma, but... I just bought it and I'm waiting for it to get here and I low-key feel like it's going to take forever to get here because I didn't spend $75. Every Most of the time that I buy stuff on Fashion Nova, I always spend up to $75 to at least get free shipping or a little bit more than $75. But 
I'm just like, I'm not going to force myself to buy stuff that I don't need right now just so I can get the free shipping because the shipping ended up being like $3 and something. So I'm just like, it was not even that serious. But I just feel like because it's not, you know, at that free shipping mark, they're not even going to push to ship it out quickly. But I guess I will just wait and see what happens with it. I'd really love if it came on the quicker side. So I still have enough time to try it on, see if I love it and if anything, you know, just return it if it doesn't work for me but for the most part that is what i have going on this morning i went into a store on jimmy avenue and the store low-key sells things that fashion over sells you know boutique type stuffs type stuff and they are selling the, the things there was a there was a jumpsuit in there that i tried on and that shit was for a hundred and about 15 or 20 dollars and it's 79 dollars on fashion over and i just feel like I will buy it on Fashion Nova, use a 30% off discount code and pay for the shipping because I'm not going to pay $100 for it just to have it right there in the store. So I went in there and tried it on to see how the fit was and to see, you know, if I liked it. And then I'll just find my size on Fashion Nova. I'm not going to buy nothing for a higher price in a store. I'm sorry, I'm not doing that. Which is why every time I know that I have an event to attend or anything, I always try to shop from early or even before that, I always try to buy things that I know that, you know, I can dress up or dress down. So I always have a, something to wear. This party, however, is a little bit more fancy and more classy. So nothing that I have right now, I don't want to wear, you know? Anyways, this is where I'm going to end this vlog. Thank you guys for watching. I hope you guys enjoyed and I will see you guys in the next vlog. Mm -hmm.